How to make a caterpillar. A caterpillar, you say? <laughs> yes, a caterpillar. This is actually the largest standard balloon that, uh, that I make, that I generally offer at uh, parties. Uh, uh, you will need three balloons for this. Let's do uh, kind of a hot pink, a blue, and a light green. You blow them all up the same amount. In this case, I'm going to do six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Tie it off. Set it aside. Same thing for the other ones. Well, actually, when you're actually twisting, you're not actually going to be able to set it aside. You're going to have to set it under your arm, most likely. And not hard. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I will prove that. See? I did that. It's not hard. And six for this one. Okay. Now, what we'll do is we'll take all three of them. Make sure they're all burped. There and there. Good. Okay. We'll put them all together. And we're going to twist about a one inch, one inch in. We'll twist them all together like that. See how that is? We twisted them all together. Okay. Now we're going to start to braid this, this, uh, this thing here. Okay. What you do is you, you're holding it and you take one and then the other and then the other, just like you're braiding hair. There and there. Make sure that um, you're not getting off kilter that you're going too far to one side or the other. Make sure you always bring it back to the middle before you twist the other one. And you just keep braiding it on down. Braiding it, braiding it. You're getting towards the end. And you have to choose which point you're going to finish it off. And we're getting about there, so I'm going to finish it off here. Okay, I'm going to grab all three and I'll twist them together like that. Now, inevitably, what will happen is one will be shorter or longer than the other two. Two, two will be fairly close in size and one will be different. The one that's different I use for the head. So, I simply take it and I'm going to twist it like this, in and around. Make sure you twist it really good and get it in like that. And you can also twist these guys around too, just to make sure that they're locked in there securely. Okay, so now what you have is this, this kind of a thing. You'll make two bubbles here. The way you do that is you twist it, then you hold it, you stretch that out, you hold on to the balloon, and you let it come out the top of your hand. Then I do that to kind of keep it like that. Okay, again, I twist it, I pull it up, I hold on to the balloon, I'm, and I'm going to squeeze this part, and it pops out the top of my hand like that. Okay, so there you have your antenna sort of things. With the caterpillar, I take it and I twist it like that, so it gives it a little character, like it's, you know, crawling along. And then, the cute face, of course, with the tongue sticking out. Two eyes, little nostrils, big old smile, and we forgot the tongue. No, we didn't. I was just kidding you. The tongue. And that is a very fast, fun, nice caterpillar, if I do say so myself. Thank you very much for watching, and please subscribe.